vertical bite wings are indicated when moderate to severe bone loss is suspected, or if either the maxillary or mandibular bone levels are not visible on a previously taken horizontal bite wing. If the patient has no missing teeth and the eights are present, three vertical bite wings are often required on each side. The instrument is assembled as follows. We use the same straight rod, the same adhesive bite block and the same positioning ring as we did for horizontal bite wings, but the difference is that the receptor is held vertically rather than horizontally. I usually find that a size 1 direct sensor is recommended when doing bite wings using the direct sensor. Patients often find a size 1 sensor easier to tolerate and to close together. Always make sure that the fibre optic cable from the direct sensor is coming out of the top um, of your assembly so that the patient can close completely together onto the bite block here. Always make sure that the patient is closing completely together onto the bite block before making an exposure.